Everyone should have a shot at health. Human life is very fragile. It's really important to show up for people in some of the most vulnerable times of their life. What a difference that can make. I think the future of medicine simply belongs to those who build it better. The idea of building a school at the convergence of medicine and engineering is so exciting. We need the next generation of healthcare workers to be able to practice more efficiently. And at the heart of our school is technology, using technologies to accelerate access, scale access to care, and improve outcomes. Honor Health is so excited to be the primary clinical affiliate for the John Schufelt School of Medicine and Medical Engineering. We're trying to approach healthcare differently. I think, frankly, our industry has taken a lot of criticism, maybe even too much focus on how do we treat people on the back end. I see a different direction coming where we're going to be more engaged with people on the front end. We're not building a medical center like many universities have. We're not even building a regular medical school. We're building a new kind of medical engineering school. Program design that allows us to expand the way that that medical school will operate over time. And it is a part of the university, but it's also a part of ASU Health, which is an initiative of the university to affect the outcomes of Arizonans' health across all of the various parts of our society. Our students are going to be fully immersed in both cultures from the very beginning medical culture as well as engineering. They will be duly trained. They will learn how to read both literatures so that they will be physician, engineer, entrepreneurs who will really transform the future of healthcare. When I heard President Crow talk about the medical school, I immediately thought, I know what I'm doing for the next 30 years. I'm in. We are so excited to announce that we've received preliminary accreditation from the LCME. What that means is that we have been reviewed by the professional body that accredits medical schools, and it means that we are ready to open our doors to recruit our first class who will be joining us in 2026. You know, the reason we wanted to partner with ASU specifically is because ASU is renowned in its commitment to innovation and research, and they get things done. It has the infrastructure, it has the talent, it has the leadership, and most importantly, it has the mindset. We don't simply need more physicians. What we do need is more physicians who can innovate, who are leaders, who can do it with a high degree of compassion. That's why I'm so excited about ASU, because I know that's what we'll be teaching. John Schufelt is, in many ways, the embodiment of the spirit of what we're trying to do, embraces what we're working on. We're going to be able to move faster because of his support. It's an accelerant. It's this spirit of jumping off the cliff with us to get this thing going that I really want to thank John and his family for. It allows me the chance to help create something and to be on the ground floor of something that doesn't just add to the medical education, it doesn't just add to the healthcare system, it actually drastically improves it. Now is the time for healthcare and education to be a part of the solution. We're building a school that really is a school, not just for today, but for the future. This school, I believe, is a blueprint for a new generation of leaders. People who don't just accept the status quo, but who have the skills, vision, and courage to change it. In this new age of medical professionals, they'll be tech savvy, they'll be lifestyle medicine savvy. These students won't just adapt to change, but they're gonna thrive on change, and they're gonna drive change to make a system better. I love ASU. There is no better place for innovation to happen. We are absolutely set up to change the world.